Let me all stand for the pledge, please, this time. <laughs> Thank you. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Madam Clerk Pro Tem, please call the, the roll, please. Trustee Bender? Here. Trustee Cook? Here. Joy Sellers and... She's absent. Is absent and... Supervisor Sellers is here. Supervisor Sellers? Here. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's been a while. That's <laughs> all right. The first order of business is the approval of minutes for the October 7th, 2019 meeting. So moved. Uh, motion second, please. Okay, so move. We need a second. Second. Motion by Bennett, second by Trustee Cook. Questions on the minutes? Mm -mm. All righty. All in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion carries. The next order of minutes is approval of bills payable. I need a motion and a second, please. So moved. I need a second. Second. <laughs> motion by Bender, second by Trustee Cook. Please take a look at bills payable. Who is MAAK Investments? They, they are a, they own property here in, in Freeport. I will look and see exactly who they are. Okay. And I will have an answer for you all. Okay. Okay, so our office, we have all the properties within Freeport Township, but without going one by one to see what properties match a property address to a mailing address, that would be the only way for me to determine, you know, which ones may be rentals. However, the county assessor's office has owner-occupied exemptions because they handle the exemptions, and so they could probably, you know, they may be able to give you a list of the ones that are not receiving owner-occupied exemptions. Have you ever looked at the, the assessor's site? Yes. And if you see, like, 704 South Saxby, it'll have my name. Let's say I'm renting it or buying it on contract from someone, then it'll have the address of the actual owner down below. I have a suggestion. Maybe I can have our CFO get me a vendor listing. Yeah, of like people that get township checks. Of then the we could look up those addresses specifically, mm -hmm. right? And be more mm -hmm. just yep. aware of who those people are. Okay. Right. I can do that. I'll and have the rental a rental information mm -hmm. sheet has mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And I can, I can take a look at that. See if I can't get something like that compiled. Okay? Yeah. M A A. Okay, investments also caught my eye. It just sounds so mm -hmm. vague. Uh huh. And I think they're out of Dubuque, if I remember correctly. Would, the, would they be uh, registered with the county clerk under the Assumed Name Act? I don't know. Because if they're doing business in this county? They should okay. be. Maybe. There's a registration of the county clerk. It's called the Illinois Assumed Name Act. If you're not a corporation, but you're doing business under uh, other than your own name, you're supposed to register with them. And they put a, public, a notice of, by publication in a newspaper or general publication usually too. 
And are you looking to get anybody that all the properties that a specific owner would own then in Freeport? Mm. Well, wouldn't, is that we, what you're looking for? That just, I don't know, that just seems like a good oversight. I, I, I think, I, I think what, what, you, what you're looking for is the vendor listing of the, the, the companies or landlords who are receiving yeah. uh, money from Township for right. clients. Yeah. Okay. And like, without the clients name. Without the client's name. Yeah. Right. Client's just the name and and everything else they own with it. Yeah. Well. Just, that'd be just good information. That I can help compile. Okay. If we have the names we want to look up. If okay. It's an owner. Okay. It's good to know who owns everything in town and who's getting uh -huh. what is tax mm -hmm. assistance. Mm -hmm. And make sure they're not putting down owner occupied. Mm -hmm. Or any number of things, like yeah. getting somehow uh -huh. with the owner occupied. Uh, water assistance or whatever, you <laughs> know. Right. Just always. We can always cross reference and make sure we are. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Any questions, more questions or claims and demands? Madam Clerk, please call the roll. Trustee Bender? Aye. Trustee Cook? Yes. Trustee S Supervisor Sellers? Aye. Motion carries. Thank you. Thank you. <coughs> the next order of business is the Supervisor's Report. What I'm going to hand out is a copy of our expansion of the budget report for and I have a copy right okay go. Go. our celebration for success event was a huge success um, it was it was very nice I I, I went I went to it and, and didn't know I was going to have to MC the event but we, 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 we made it we made it through. We did, we did it very well. Um, it was a a very good turnout. We had a quite a quite a very good turnout. Um, we actually had a sheet cake donated to us from uh, Cubs, and they donated a sheet cake to us and 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 some other things for for refreshments, and it went very 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 well. Very excited. So, any questions we have on uh, spring of the budget report? I know you guys are looking at the program. That's the water program. Mm -hmm. I know the name of the program that you're talking about that you celebration of success. Thank you. All righty. The next order of business is the assessor's report. And all I have to report is that we're a little over halfway in the appeal process. So November 1st is the last day if anyone needs to appeal their assessed value. That's it. All right. Next order of business is trustees' report. Trustees. Nothing. Nothing. Right. Oh. Yeah. Well, I just have one question on this. The 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 water program, mm -hmm. that is almost a year, right? We started that when? We started February. in February. February. Yeah. All right. Any other questions? All right. Any public comments? Any other business come? Any other business coming for the town? Then I'll entertain a motion to adjourn until November fourth, two thousand nineteen. So moved. Second. Motion by Bender, second. Trustee Cook. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? Motion carries. Meeting is adjourned.